Well, good afternoon, Michelle. So Michelle here has a question. Michelle wants to say she's not picking a fight, but she wants to know why I'm okay voting with someone with 91 felony counts. So Michelle, I'm going to give you my answer. Ready? Because I'm tired. I am sick and fucking tired of the way this country looks under Democrat leadership. These felony counts don't mean shit to me. You know what that means to me? That the Democrat Party just want to get him off the campaign trail. Because if he was really guilty of anything, he'd be sitting in jail right now. And then you have to kind of ask yourself, why now? If Donald Trump's businesses were so corrupt, how come he wasn't indicted prior to him becoming president? Did you ever ask yourself that question? No, because all those people that are calling him corrupt had their collective hands in his pockets prior to him becoming a politician. They were all buddy-buddy with him until he became president. You see, Donald Trump, out of both candidates, is the only one calling for peace right now. Not Joe Biden. I'm sick and tired of the way this country looks, Michelle, under Democrat leadership. I'm sick and tired of watching the riots in the streets. I'm sick and tired of watching our public monuments being defaced and absolutely just taken down and all our history erased. I am sick and tired of the indoctrination happening to our college kids and to our high school children and even younger. And you know what I mean by the crazy. I'm tired of all of it. I am tired of watching over 10 million people be allowed into this country and being dropped into cities to the point where now the cities are having to cut back on programs that minority communities need. All to house people here that aren't even legal citizens. They're getting handed money. They're getting handed education, health care, housing. Do Americans get that? No. I'm sick and tired of watching this country's border be absolutely decimated by the Democrat Party and them not giving two shits about it. I am sick and tired of the politicians and their lip service. I am tired of watching politicians go into offices that usually pays about 150 to 200 K a year, but come out millionaires. And yet somehow you want me to think the guy that's got businesses all around the world that employs all sorts of people, black, white, red, handicapped, is somehow corrupt. But the guy in office for 50 plus years who hasn't accomplished shit is somehow a millionaire with zero businesses. But you want me to think that the other guy is corrupt, but not this one? Donald Trump, out of the both candidates, is the only one who's actually calling for peace in the Middle East right now and peace between Ukraine and Russia, while Joe Biden just keeps giving billions and billions and billions of our dollars away to that country with zero accounting of where any of that money is being spent. Meanwhile, our border is wide open. And thousands have come across the day, every single day. And they're going to sit on our dime as taxpayers. I'm tired of being taxed to fucking death, Michelle. I'm tired of living in a 50-year high inflation. I'm tired of 8.5% interest rates. I am sick and tired of the way our economy and our country looks. That's why. That is why I'll be voting for Donald Trump. Because I already saw the job that Donald Trump did. And he did a great job. And our economy was strong until COVID happened. And let's bring up COVID. If nothing during COVID has taught you to open your mind and think for yourself, then I don't know what will. I'm tired of the mainstream media painting narratives that Donald Trump is a dictator. He's Hitler. He's Putin. I'm tired of it. I saw the job that he did, and he did a good job. And this country is a mess, and I'm tired. I'm tired of the riots in the street. I'm tired of watching businesses being looted and robbed in broad daylight. I'm tired of going to the grocery store and seeing everything behind glass. I'm tired of watching criminals get let right back out of jail to go do crime again. I'm tired, Michelle. So all of these felony counts don't mean shit to me because if he really was guilty of doing any of them, they would have been half that way prior to him becoming president. But they didn't seem to care about his businesses then. They only seem to care about them now. I'm tired of the corruption. I'm tired of politicians getting rich off of our backs. I'm tired, Michelle. So no. These felony counts don't mean shit to me because I know it's just more political grandstanding by Joe Biden and the Democrat Party because he's getting their absolute pants beaten off of them in this next election. I'm tired of the cheating, Michelle. I'm tired of the election bullshit. I'm tired of ballot stuffing. I'm tired. And so is the rest of the American people. We're tired. We are sick and tired of the way that this country looks, and we're going to rally behind the guy who wants to put America first policies in place, who wants to cut back regulations instead of regulate businesses more. We want to rally behind the guy that wants to close our border up. We want to rally behind that guy, the guy who wants to put America first, not a bunch of lip service and crazy. I'm tired. That's why. I'm tired of the way this country looks under Democrat leadership. And you know what? It seems like that's growing. Because more and more people a day will come to my DMs and they'll talk to me and they'll say, you know, I may not like him as a person, but I'm going to vote for him. Because they're tired too. 
So no, I don't care about felony counts because if he was really guilty of something, I tell you right now, he'd be in jail and he's not, and he's never going to be in jail. So the more you get excited about the idea of him being in jail, just know that it's never going to happen. It's a political witch hunt by Joe Biden and the Democrat party and everyone's around to see it. So I hope I answered your question because I am sick and tired of what this country looks like under Democrat leadership. I want our country to be strong. I want our military to be strong. I want our citizens to not sit in their cars and cry, wondering where their money's gonna come from to pay bills or even get Christmas for their kids. I'm tired and I want this country back to some normalcy. I'm just tired. So that's why. Hope I answered your question. Trump 2024. Good talk.